Now at 7, the tributes continue for Frank Ordonez as family and friends prepare for final goodbyes. The UPS driver was killed last week in a shootout between police and two robbery suspects. Tonight, his loved ones want the focus to be less on how he died and more on how he lived. CBS 4's Hank Tester is in Miami with more on how Ordonez is being remembered. Hank. Well, we're at the Vior Funeral Home on 37th Avenue here in Miami. A steady stream of folks coming to pay respects. Today, a nationwide moment of silence for the slain UPS driver. A time to remember to begin closure if it can ever come. Family, co workers, friends gather a viewing for slain UPS driver Frank Ordonez. Ordonez died last Thursday, caught up in the robbery chase shootout. Two suspects died. So did innocent bystander Richard Cutshaw. Frank Ordonez was kidnapped, his truck hijacked. He died inside his UPS truck. Now today, nationwide, at 5 p.m. Eastern Time, UPS trucks parked with four-way flashers on, observed a minute of silence for Frank Ordonez. Frank, Frank was like, oh my gosh. Near tears, 15-year-old Genevieve Marino says it's painful to talk about her 27-year-old brother. Frank was just like a... I don't even know how to say it because... His father, his sister, talk about happier times with CBS4's Peter Dench. He always wanted the best for me. He was there for me. You know, I'm never going to find someone like Frank ever again. And I know it because Frank was one of a kind. Of course he loved his family. Look at what he for the babies, for the girls. That's what he would do for them. Ordonez was the father of two young children. So happy all the time. And we all loved him. He always wanted us to, you know, get along. A family goal, keep the memory, the legacy of 27-year-old Frank Ordonez alive. I, I want uh, Frank's legacy not to be forgotten. Um, we want Frank uh, to live through the media. Uh, you are the only ones, you are the only ones that are going to keep this alive, his, his life alive. Well, back live here. The viewing will continue till 1 a.m. Burial tomorrow. I'm Hank Chester, CBS 4 News at 7. Back to you. Hank, thank you. Frank Ordonez will be buried tomorrow afternoon at Vista Memorial Gardens and Funeral Home in Miami Lakes. The address is 14200 Northwest 57th Avenue. The service begins at 1230. And stay with CBS 4 News as we continue to follow the investigation into the deadly police chase. You can always find the very latest on our website, cbsmiami.com.